Attention! Although my content is usually family-friendly and suitable for all ages, Phoenix Wright Justice for All is a game that has been rated T by the ESRB content rating system, and as such, the videos in this Let's Play may contain blood, mild violence, and or suggestive themes. So, viewer discretion is advised. Welcome back to Phoenix Wright Justice for All, everybody. Praise be to God on this amazing day. Uh, Marty's had two and donuts what today. What an amazing day it has been. <laughs> Marty has oh. had two donuts today. I've had one donut today. So they were unrelated as well. That's true. We went to two completely different places today. So oh, man. we're continuing with Reunion and Turnabout. Yeah. Yeah, that's an afterthought. And Turnabout. Part free investigation. Let's go. June 21st, 3.24 p.m. Corrine Village. Thank you very much for bringing me home, Mr. Nick. You're welcome. I had to come and look into a few things here today anyway. Um, I thought about this a little. If Mystic Maya didn't kill that nice man... She definitely didn't. Yes, of course! Yeah. But if she didn't, then someone else did, right? Um, that murderer person! Yes, Pearls. Oh... I see. I wonder what's wrong. She seems sad. What if she saw the murder? No! Marty, can no! you get a hold of yourself? No, I don't want another child witnessing murder and being sad. So, what did you think of seeing your first trial? I was really surprised! I'd never seen so many people before! Uh, oh. And Mystic Maya looked so small and helpless. Well, Maya's already naturally short, so... I wonder how short she is. And then, that snobby woman with the roughly clothes! Roughly? Oh, she means Franziska. She had such a bad attitude! She acted like she had already decided Mystic Maya did it! I'm going to tell her what I think of her tomorrow! I wouldn't miss tomorrow's trial for the world. Yes! <laughs> you tell him, Pearl! Oh, man. Why was that woman bullying Mystic Maya? Well, she's the opposite of a lawyer. A prosecutor, so her job is to prove people guilty. They don't care if someone's innocent. All they care about is if they win. Th that's terrible! But, but she's a really good prosecutor with a heart on the inside, right? There's no one like that. All prosecutors are the same. What? How dare he? Well, he might have become a good guy. Eventually. He? Who are you talking about, Mr. Nick? Is it that person Mystic Maya was talking about? Mr. Edgyworth? That was a long time ago. He's not around anymore. Huh? He clutched onto his foolish pride too fiercely and died for it. Really? He's dead? Oh. Oh, that's too bad. Well, that was the wham line for the episode, isn't it? We got it real early. I forgot about that. He's seriously dead. Yeah, it looks like it. What could he have done? I mean, he's a prosecutor, but like, he's the dude that drinks tea and <laughs> like in his spare time and plays chess. Uh, well, apparently, apparently he also lost to Deep Blue, and that also sent him over the edge. I don't know. <laughs> Oh, man. Over the edge, wolf. Oh. <laughs> oh. By the way. Yes. What is it? Um, you wouldn't happen to know anything about who the murderer is, would you? Uh, well, why are you asking me? No, I was just thinking earlier. I didn't see anything. She didn't oh. see anything, huh? Speaking of that, during the murder. Where was Pearls and what was she doing? I don't know. And on top of that, this key. Just when did she pick this up? I just realized that I never asked you what you were doing at the time of the crime. Pearls, where were you and what were you doing when the murder happened? Uh... Hmm? Wh what I was doing? Uh, I w wasn't doing anything! She's really bad at lying. You can whisper it to me. I won't tell anyone else. I promise. Ah! Um, I guess you can see through my lie, huh? Yeah, clearly. Can't lie to you, can I, Mr. Nick? 
Oh boy. So she's hiding something from us. Ironic that she's the one who gave us the lie detector. Uh, I could have noticed she was even if we didn't have Oh, her. well, yeah. June 21st, Wright and Company Law Offices. This case has had me out of the office most of the time. I can come back tomorrow. Helping Maya should be my top priority now. But your plants! Charlie! Alright, alright, we'll check out Charlie, see if there's different dialogue. Charlie, a quite decorative plant. He's a handful, but I've got grown quite attached to the little fella. He also helps me to remember all the good times with Mia. Oh, it, it was different. There's a giant building just outside the window. It's the Gatewater Hotel, a high-class luxury hotel. Until recently, it had been a normal business-class hotel. Oh, that was the same. Okay, only Charlie had different dialogue. Then. Thanks, Charlie. Yeah. You're awesome. Oh, boy. June 21st, Meanwhile. Detention Center Visitor's Room. Maya must still be in questioning. She'll probably be done in a little bit, so I'll come back later. Aw, oh, really? I want to go. What are you doing now? This is America! Or Japan Oh, is this Pearl's theme? Yeah. It reminds me of Kirby, so therefore I love it. Yeah, I, I like her theme as well. Really cheerful. Oh boy, Morgan's gonna have her head. June 21st, Faye Manor Meditation Room. Heads, I guess. It's really empty. I mean, we're kind of all head. At least our avatars are. <laughs> sure. No, but two heads working to have one head in this game. Oh. There's supposed to be training he held today, but I guess it's already over. Training for what? Tea art ceremony? No, for spirit channeling. Oh. June 21st, Fay Manor Channeling Chamber. Hmm, looks like Morgan's here too, but she hasn't noticed me yet. What is she doing? She looks like she's talking to a picture. Huh? Uh, that's an evil grin. <laughs> Don't you see? Take a look around. Finally, my chance has come. What? I've waited for this day for so long! That's right. Prepare yourself, dear Misty. What? Oh, the... Well, who's there? I mean, <laughs> she's talking to her sister. That makes sense. Or her sister-in-law. No, nope, sister. sister. Oh, if it isn't Mr. Wright. Um, just curious, but that picture you were just looking at. Oh, today was that event, was it not, good sir? I heard you did well. Huh? Oh, yes. Thank you. I am terribly sorry I could not attend the trial today. Please accept my apology. I had a previous engagement, so as to watch over the trainee's training today. I get the sense she really doesn't want to talk about the picture. All because the master can't be here with us, you understand. And that is why a lowly branch family member such as myself must do this. <laughs> yeah, you keep chugging that candle. <laughs> that candle of paint. The candle of paint. <laughs> Don't burn paint, kids. That's a very <laughs> bad idea. <laughs> Have you remembered something about the murder? No, I told you everything I know already. Is the thing gonna just pop up? <laughs> <laughs> Were you in this room the whole time when Wada and I went to call the police? Yes, of course. I was by Mystic Maya's side the entire time. I performed the spirit severing technique and held her in my arms afterward. Hmm. You said that yesterday as well. Did anything else happen? I would like to say more did. However, that's all that occurred. Ah, uh, I was really hoping for some new info. I suppose nothing's happened in the end, good sir. Sorry to have played on your hopes. Why do I feel like I was just made fun of in the worst way possible? Training! So do the students train every day? Yes, absolutely. They were given a day off the day after the murder. Of course, however. And I assume both Maya and Pearls went through this training? Mr. Wright! Ah, yes, yes! Wow, she got real scary real fast. How many times must I tell you before you understand, good sir? They are to be addressed as Mystic Maya and Mystic Pearl. S sorry, I meant Mystic Maya and Mystic Pearl. Wait, I'm sorry, but Mystic Pearl? Isn't that going a bit too far? Next question, please. Oh man, she's really being a pain in the butt about this. Please remember to watch not only what you say, but how you say it, good sir. She's being rude, but in the most polite like, way, way possible. possible. Yeah. Which is annoying. So the master is, um, Maya's mother, right? Mystic. Misty. She's a brilliant medium. And where is she now? We are not sure. Not sure? 
about 16 or 17 years ago. Mystic M Mystic Misty, that's hard to say. Mystic Misty, Mystic Misty, Mystic Misty. Mystic Misty failed as channeling its certain spirit. And after that, she simply disappeared. I don't believe she will return to this village, in any case. And in four years' time, her name will be forever erased from this village. Erased? A person who has been away from the village for over 20 years is considered dead. Oh, I see. And that is four years from now for her. When that happens, a new master will be appointed to Korean Village. Oh! Maybe that'll be her! Who? Morgan or Maya? Morgan! Well, could maybe Maya, but maybe Morgan if Morgan's trying to kill off Maya. That would be terrible. Yes, it would, but it could happen! <laughs> and, I mean, I feel like more. Maybe Morgan's been hitting the paint fumes a little too much. Maybe. Or her hair know. has got that one streak. Also, what is up with her hair? It's like the beehive hairdo from Max and Ruby. <laughs> Not as vertical as that. Mystic Maya was supposed to become the next master. However, with this murder, I'm afraid. I must be imagining things. I thought she was laughing to herself for a second there. Uh-huh. That's what I was saying. Maybe she's trying to bump Maya off, or at least... Maybe not bump Maya off, but ruin her reputation to become a master. Even if she mm. is not bumped off, but maybe like, oh, if, if it looks like she did it, then I could be the next master, well, and well, I could have achievement, well, and little pearly my adorableness could have <laughs> achievement. I don't know. <clears throat> well, I mean, the master is the toughest boss in Paper Mario, so I understand that. Is <laughs> it? Oh, okay. What do you think about this? It's my attorney's badge. <laughs> I'm terribly sorry, but I'm afraid my spiritual powers are not as strong as you might think. I really am terribly sorry. Um, but this has nothing to do with your spiritual power. <laughs> oh, what? What did she say with the key? This. This is the key to this room. That's right. But, but why do you have it, good sir? That, I'm not telling you. Return it at once! I... I can't. It's evidence, after all. To think she knows exactly how important this key is to this murder. But what is this feeling I'm getting from her? It feels... Hmm... I can't describe it. Complete anger? <laughs> oh, 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 I hope you don't mind, but someone shot your folding screen. There are six parts to the Korean sacred writings. To think that this valued treasure of our village and Mystic Maya were both shot by a gun. Well, that's... Even if it was something that occurred during the channeling, it is an unforgivable act. Uh-huh. Hey, Morgan, can I have one of your desserts? Yo, I haven't Morgan, had dessert. let me show you Maya's bloody costume. <laughs> Stick up, Morgan! Never mind. <laughs> She's like, I'm terribly sorry. Let's show her the costume. Maya's bloody newspaper yeah. clippings, yeah. yeah. That is Mystic Maya's costume, isn't it? It's a shame. I never thought anything like that would happen to her. But we don't she know. Says, sipping it. But we don't know that it was Maya that did it. Oh, poor Mystic Maya. Do you ever listen to anyone other than yourself? Or is she just not admitting that she thinks it could be her? Oh. <laughs> She's like an autopsy report, really. Uh, about... What do you think about this? Oh, darn it. Let's talk about. <laughs> <laughs> nope, nothing about Francisca. Oh, a lot of heart? Come on. No, doggone it. How about herself? Oh, hang on, Mia. Oh my. I think I may know of this person from somewhere. It's Mia. You know, Maya's older sister? Ah, uh, yes, that is who she is. How could you forget a daughter of the master? If memory serves, she became a lawyer. Oh, how splendid for her, don't you think? That soft, kind smile. It's the kind that tells you a pair of devil horns are not too far away. I wonder why she forgot. Well, how many years, though, had it been since she had left the village? Mia left the village definitely over five. Uh, how old was Mia? I mean, she's deceased now, but... She was 26 or 27, I believe, when she Okay. Died. Okay. I believe Mia left... Five or six years ago from this case. 
Um, okay, so not like super long. That's weird. Yeah, you'd think Bob she'd Morgan. recognize her. Later, lady with the beehive hairdo. All right, let's see if Eeny Miney. Like studying parapsychology. <laughs> sure. <laughs> Looks like there's no one here. Great. And even though the weather is gorgeous today, it's raining inside my heart. Oh my gosh, like eeny miny. Like, wait, June 21st, Fay Manor side room. The bedding is all laid out today, too. Guess I'll leave them alone for now. Oh, she's not here! Oh, I examine everything. Hey, let's go through our trunk. <laughs> hmm, I keep wondering about this box. I'm sure this wasn't here before the murder took place. It looks like a box for storing clothes, but it's pretty big for just clothes. It's mostly empty, but a few folded pieces of channeling costume sit at the bottom. Look at her bed. <laughs> Excuse me. Who am I talking to? There's no one here. Check the other bed. No clues here. Oh, that sucks. Um, that's it? Oh. Wow, okay. What's happening? Maybe Maya's out of questioning now. Maybe. Yeah, maybe after we talk to Morgan. Let's go... Hi. What's up? Goodbye. Two hour train right Wait, what? later. Wait, uh, Maybe we need to oh, trigger we something. Yeah, we gotta. We're probably gonna present something. Do, 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 do. Oh, the key, how about? About this key, Pearls? You found it on the day of the murder, right? Yes. Now, where you found this key is very important. So, please tell me, Pearl, where did you find this? Um. I found it in the incinerator. The incinerator? Hmm, is she talking about the one in the garden? The door on it was a little open, so I took a peek. When? Uh, when was that? It was after the channeling, when everyone was in a panic. Hmm. Um, Mr. Nick? Yes? Are you going to tell my mother? Huh? You mean tell Morgan what you did? Yes. If she finds out that I was playing in the leftover trash... I'll get a spanking. Ah, gotcha. Well, let's keep it as a secret from her then, alright? Hmm, the incinerator, huh? Sounds like a good place to search next. Okay, that's it. See ya. Later! Peace out. Morgan's just like, why is this dude walking all over my house? <laughs> <laughs> okay. Alright, here we go, winding way again. Hey, there's someone by the incinerator. Ooh, looks like they've noticed me. And they are now running at top speed towards me. Oh, hey! <laughs> like, <laughs> you're that dentist guy. Actually, it's Phoenix Wright, attorney at law. Nice to see you again. Ooh, like, real suave. So it's, like, my turn. It's nice to see you, too. So, what's up? You're all out of breath. <laughs> like, huh? Oh, like, you mean, like, I'm just totally happy and, like, totally excited to be here. Excited? Like, I mean, there are so many things to, like, see. It's, like, the real deal here. Oh, really? For example? For example, like, that urn over there. Do you, like, know about it? All I see is an old, cracked piece of pottery. This is honestly my favorite music, I think. Really? in this game thus far. I don't know why. It's just paired up with her dancing. It's perfect. <laughs> no one can see us. This is no just the generic investigation theme, too, so we'll hear it quite a bit, I right. think, throughout the game. It's just nice. I will never think of it, though, without thinking of her. Most people don't. <laughs> is there some sort of legend connected with that urn? Like, yeah! It's like this village's treasure. I am. Huh. That is. My soul shall wield My sword for me. shall wield for me. For me. <laughs> That's My a soul, red wall. You know. <laughs> <laughs> it's kind of the same thing. Huh, didn't know that. And, like, it's sealed inside from that urn. Um, it's? What are you talking about? Like, you know, Ami Face Spirit. Is that Ami or Amy? Because I've always thought it was Amy. It could be Amy or Ami, I don't know. Amy Faye? Who's that? Like, jeez, Mr. Smith, get with the Program. Everyone knows the lady that founded the Korean channeling technique was Mystic Amy. Um, don't have to get upset with me. So, like, as long as her spirit, like, lives in the urn, 
The spiritual power of the Fae family will stick around. Like, isn't that totally romantic? Um, romantic, huh? If that urn is really as important as she says, it could be a vital clue. What if we break it? It looks like it could shatter in two seconds! <laughs> well, just be careful with it. Great. Eni, I want to ask you about the murder. Murder? Dr. Gray's Remember? As if there's another one! Oh, that one! Like, you should have said so in the first place. So, like, I totally don't know anything because I was, like, sleeping in the side room. Well, that's not much help. Did you notice anything at all? Uh, like, come on! What a total bore. I, like, totally have nothing to do with this, like, murder thing. Oh, yeah. You only introduced Dr. Gray to Korean Village. No relation, sure. Even if you were only acquaintances, that still means you knew him. Furthermore, your sister, who died in that accident, was a nurse at his clinic. Alright then, why don't you tell me about your sister's fatal accident? Yeah, great, great. conversation <laughs> topic, Phoenix. I know what I'm I know what I'm gonna use as a pickup line from now on. <laughs> like, why? You think like it's got something to like do with the murder? I don't know yet, but I'm trying to chase down every lead I have. Well yeah, that makes uh, sense. A psych lock. Like what is it? Looks like I'm gonna need something to pry her mouth open on this one. So that's the thing, generally speaking, when you encounter someone's psychologs, you do not have what it takes to break them at the current time. Well, let's examine that incinerator while she- wait, what the? That's right. Pearl said she found this key inside the incinerator. I guess I should take a look inside for myself. Th this this is for Maya's costume! But it wasn't there earlier! There's blood on it. A tiny bit, but still. Cloth scrap added to the court record. Dun, 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 dun. Why is she so dang happy? Because she's ignoring the sadness in her heart. <laughs> probably. She, pro she also is probably not rolling on all four cylinders. No. Hey, Morgan, what's up? Oh, never mind. Goodbye. Oh, wait, let's present the piece of bloody cloth to her. To who? Pearl? Pearl. What if that, like, is a clue? What if that, like, opens her heart? Good idea. Her psych lock. Oh, I'm it's... sure it is helpful to you in some way, but I'm still in training, so I don't know anything about it. I'm really deeply sorry. No, 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 it's okay. I shouldn't have shown you something so trivial anyway. I'm very sorry. This feels so weird, talking to a kid like this. We don't have enough to open her psych locks yet. Okay. Let's ask her about various people, though. To tell you the truth, I really want to grow my hair out just like Mystic Maya. But my mother wouldn't let me. She's got her in the pretzel mod, apparently. I think your hair now suits you perfectly. But really? Thank you! I could see her doing the <laughs> long hair. Did you? Gears, 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 yeah, I got gears. No. <laughs> <laughs> Not that. <laughs> Fortunate! <laughs> great Mouse Detective is a great movie, you should see it. I forgot about that movie. So good. I look up to Mystic Maya a lot. She's my role model. She's so smart and pretty and kind and loving. She's always cheerful, never gets sick, never isn't, isn't picky and has good sleeping habits. She always wakes up before me and always eats breakfast before me, too. And she has you! Such a wonderful person who- Ah, okay, okay, I get the idea! She really thinks the world of Maya, doesn't she? I knew her for a little while. Mystic Mia was your teacher, right? I'm sure she was a great master of lawyers. Master of lawyers, I guess? I mean, it's not exactly a martial art. You should keep training, Mr. Nick. Y yeah, you're probably right. Just curious, how long has this video been going on for? Oh, okay. Not even at the half hour mark. That's great. Come on, Maya. Yeah. Hey, Maya. June 21st, oh, detention center, ball. visitor's room. Hey, Nick. I've been waiting. She looks so helpless. So? So how was it? What did you find out? Um, well, I found a few things. 
my eyes are tearing up, Nick. Don't make me cry. Uh, I just need a little more time. It'll all come together by tomorrow, I promise. I'm sorry, Nick. Every time I see you, all I do is cause trouble. So much for the always cheerful thing. Uh, yeah. She's always cheerful and all pretty. <laughs> she sleeps. It's get all really awesome too. We have so much in common. <laughs> so how was it? Today's trial, I mean. You were fantastic, Nick. Every time I thought our goose was cooked, you managed to turn it all around. I bet it would make a great Hollywood movie. Don't be silly. Maybe a video game. <laughs> yeah. We have to concentrate on the trial. We're going to win this, Maya. Thanks a lot. Really. Hey, Nick? The person who shot Dr. Gray wasn't me, was it? Of course not. You're completely innocent. If that were true, then I'd be really happy, but... There wasn't anyone else in that room with the two of us, right? What if Pearl was in there and shot him? No! <laughs> no! It could be exactly like the other case. <laughs> Cody <laughs> didn't kill the guy! No, I'm saying the other case. Case. Edgeworth didn't shoot the guy. No, but like staged like that, but having it actually happen. Oh, that would be so. Oh. Okay, well yeah, we we have literally nothing connecting that. At all. I know. Well, oh, did, did you check behind the folding screen? Um, I took a quick glance, but there wasn't anyone there. Hmm, that's exactly what Lotta said too. Um, Nick. Yeah. Why do you believe in me? Why do you think I didn't kill Dr. Gray? Because of something Mia told me. My sis? What did she tell you? She said that spirit mediums can't have dreams. When you're channeling, it's impossible for you to dream because your soul leaves you. Now that you mention it... Wait! Then... then I really am... You are not the real murderer. I think that maybe before you even called the spirit, you were drugged. Drugged? I think this was planned from the very beginning. And you were set up to take the blame for killing Dr. Gray. That's... that's... I want to ask you something about Pearls. Pearly? What about her? No matter what I try, she won't answer me. I want to know what she was doing at the time of the murder. Hmm... W wait! Nick! You don't think she did it, do you? No, no, nothing like that. She'd never do anything like that, you hear me? Never! She's a great kid, and really cute, and really great, and cute. I didn't really think she was the murderer, but she's definitely hiding something. Hmm. You were with her on that day, right? Yeah, the two of us. We were playing with her ball. A ball, huh? Sounds like a dead end to me. But let's ask That's him about it anyway! <laughs> so, about this ball... It's nothing really special. Just a plain old ball. I think she was still playing with it when I started the channeling job that day. Pearly really loves to play with that ball. She loves to play with that ball, huh? When she wants to get it, she always climbs right into the clothing box. The clothing box? Yeah. Pearly's always hiding in there. You know the side room. There's a clothing box in there. It's really big, so once you see it, I'm sure you'll know what I'm talking about. The clothing box in the side room, huh? Alright. There's a couple clothes in there. Yeah, there, there was. I wonder... What? If her ceremonial costume was in there. I'm sure there were a bunch of costumes exactly like Maya's in there. Okay, so box. maybe it was in there, and Morgan was like, Come, it's time for you to get changed for your spirit, and then like, <laughs> put the box in the room. <laughs> And Maya got changed or something, and then Pearl snuck out of the box because ball and played in the channeling room or something. Or well, the murder was taking the <laughs> No! Before! So she's still in the room when it was starting. Hmm. Okay. And then everyone's like, oh, Pearl's just playing with her ball. It's fine. She's not here. And they're like, okay, let us start the ceremony. I don't know. What is it? I'm not too sure myself, but I found it just now inside the furnace. Huh? Is it trash burning day already? That's not something I would know about. I guess she didn't notice the blood stain. Probably better that that way. Alright. Pearl, you're gonna talk to us. Oh, maybe not. June 21st, Korean Village. Ah! ah! <laughs> hey, 
Wait, wait! Please, Lana! She ran off into the manor. Great. What is she seeing? She's been acting so weird. There's something up. <laughs> With Lana? Was there something in that tea? <laughs> I don't know. I don't know, Lana. I'm concerned. Did, did Morgan slip, like, LSD in the tea? Yes. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> All right, meditation room. Lana. <laughs> hey! I'm telling you, quit following me, you hear? I'm a worthless piece of trash. You lay eyes on me and they turn to dust. <sighs> Wow, Lada, we gotta work on your self-esteem. Hey! Um, later. Is she hiding in the box? That'll be great. <laughs> June 21st, <laughs> Faye Manor side room. I'm pretty sure I saw Lada run in this direction. She's but it, it doesn't look like she's here. She's like, I'm sorry! <laughs> <laughs> oh, there's the ball. It's Pearl's ball. Oh, of course it's a steel samurai ball. Yeah. Why wouldn't it be? <laughs> Maya said that it's always kept it in the clothing box. So then, what is it doing here on the floor? Pearl's ball taken. What if Pearl wanted that ball back? It's the clothing box where Pearl's ball is usually kept. I wonder what's inside. Ah! What? 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 What were you doing in there? What were you thinking? I'm a bad person. Just another piece of human trash. So you crawled into this clothing box because there wasn't a hole to crawl into? Oh man, huh? There's a small hole in this clothing box. And it's about eight inches off the ground. That's the same height as the hole in the folding screen! Then, could this... There's a hole underneath the clothing box? No, on the... Oh! On the side of it. So the clothing box must have been in there. Yep. Yeah, Hello? Like Pearl's probably in there! It was like, Wah! or something. <laughs> Just like that. Wah! No, like, when the when the bullet went, because it must have gone through the basket and through the, sh the, the, um, you know, the screen. I can't talk. <laughs> Alright, meditation room. Come on, Lotta. Shut up. June 21st, Fay Manor Meditation Room. That person ran by here just now. What person? Um, you know, the person with the fluffy cotton candy hair. Ah, she means a lot of. She said, don't look at me with them eyes, but I'm not that scary, am I? I don't think that's quite what she meant. Oh, that's right. She also wanted me to tell you. Going on a trip to find myself, so don't bother finding me. That was the best Pearl does a lot of his voice ever. <laughs> oh, well, thanks. You're welcome. Okay. Lana's gone. We need her as a witness. Or something. <laughs> okay, or hang on. Uh, how much time do we have left for the episode? Okay, I think we've got time to unlock Pearl's Cyclops. Okay, okay. And then we should be able to divide this episode in half pretty nicely. Pearl's alibi. Pearl, you have to tell me what you were doing when the murder happened, okay? Um, but what if I can't just tell you what happened? Then I'll guess what happened. How does that sound? Huh? Y you couldn't do that? You'll tell me if I guess something right, won't you? Y yes Now, when the murder was taking place, you were here, right? You think it's channeling chamber? Yeah. I want to at least try it. I'm pretty smart, Pearls. I know you were right here. No, I wasn't. Huh? I'm wrong? Oh, I feel a little better. Oh, I feel a little warmer from embarrassment. I better try again. The side room, then? You think it's the side room? Well, because the basket was in there, so... I also love the Cyclops music. I'm pretty smart, girls. <laughs> no, apparently you're not, Phoenix. <laughs> no, I wasn't. <laughs> what? She wasn't there either. Nope. Where was she, the incinerator? Well, she was playing around there. Okay, incinerator, let's try that. Wow, I suck at this. You were here, weren't you, Pearls? In the winding way? Well, wow! You got it! I 
after the third three tries. <laughs> Show me. Hey, we didn't get all of them wrong. So, do you think you can tell me now? I'm sorry. Not yet. Man, oh man. All right, what next? Okay, I think I know what you were doing here. D do you really know that much? Well, I am a lawyer, you know. Now, what was it Pearls was doing in the winding way? Ball! <laughs> ball! She was playing with the ball! You're right, but um, I want to get it wrong. You had this knife, too. <laughs> <laughs> so? I feel just a little better. Huh? You are a lawyer, but you're also still a person, after all. Sorry, I'll get it right this time. Yep, you're right. You had this knife. I thought she was going to be like, how dare you? You were playing with this ball, right? Ah, oh, that's right. How how did you know? Maya told me that you love to play with your ball. Um, yeah, I was playing with my ball. Uh-huh. And then? Something happened, huh? Something really bad. Uh, well, what do you mean, something? N -n nothing happened! This is it. While you were playing with your <laughs> ball, this happened. Cloth? This one? Yeah? No. Were you so surprised that you were shocked into silence? Yes, and how wrong you are, even though you were so sure of yourself. Huh? Well, that was funny. Way to embarrass yourself in front of an eight-year-old, right? Ah, <laughs> uh, sorry, sorry. Just see if you were paying attention. <laughs> it's okay, Mr. Nick. You can always try again. All right. She's very nice and polite about it. Um, she is. What happened? Knife? Key? 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 Oh my gosh, I'm an idiot. We don't have what we need. I don't think I have enough. Oh, we don't? I completely forgot. Does that one stay empty? Or does that one that we broke stay the same? Or do we have to break it again? No, we have to break it again, unfortunately. Dang it. <sighs> I didn't check out the sacred urn. <laughs> oh, okay. So there's a spirit in this urn, huh? Hmm, all I see are a bunch of cracks. But I guess maybe the spirit can live in the space between the cracks? Hmm, looks like something's written on it. I am. Huh, weird. I thought that automatically got added when we talked to Amy. No, I guess not. All right, well, let's actually break it now. What a, what a dunce I am! I've even played this before. Wee. The next thing though is we can speed through it. Yes, so. we can. Oh yeah, both are there. That's annoying. Just appreciate the music. I am glad though that it's not just like yeah, let me tell you everything about my past instead of like you know <laughs> everything here. I made a dubstep for remix of this, so it would sound really good. There's some epic Cyclock remixes. Don't look them up! No, I wouldn't. Because it's probably like spoiler, spoiler, oh, spoiler. Oh, so, bad, so much spoilers. I mean, how else are you supposed to distinguish it, though? Right. This is the psych lock for this. Well, person. kind of spoil it. Yeah, sacred urn is what we present here. This urn, it's a village treasure, right? Ah, uh, um. And the spirit of the founder of the Korean technique is sealed in here, isn't it? Y yes. What's this? It's cracked all over, isn't it? There's even a few gaps here and there. Um, please don't tease me. Pearl, you broke the sacred urn, didn't you? The ball smacked into it and knocked it over, right? I was wondering why it looked so broken. And if Morgan found out, she'd get really mad, huh? She doesn't seem to be fighting back. I think I hit the bullseye this time. But it's strange that the lock hasn't broken yet. It's... it's a really old arm, isn't it? Eh? It's so old! So it's not that weird to have a few cracks? Her voice is shaking. H how can you tell that the arm's been broken? Ooh, good question. Do we have it this time? I believe so. Uh, can we, uh, um... Wait, no! Oh, shoot. Darn it. I'm sorry. I don't want to be mean, but... 
I meant to. Never mind. Uh, I figured. Um, do you want to try again? Yeah, I'm sure I can get it if I think about it some more. The thing I'm missing must have something to do with what's written on the urn. How can you tell? Okay, so we wasn't the pistol, we know that much. <laughs> okay. <laughs> The urn's been broken because the... What the? Ugh! She has no eyes. <laughs> Does she not? Well... Maybe it's maybe it's the shadow of the cloth, but if so... She, that freaked me out looking that's, at that. That's a little from creepy. far away. Ugh. Oh, wait, wait, hang on. She's wearing sunglasses. Or, like, goggles. If you look at closer. Oh, yeah, I can see it. Oh, I am Amy. Yeah, that seems weird, doesn't it? Who started the crane channeling technique? Uh, um, it was Mystic Amy. That's right. And how do you spell her name? Do you know? How do I spell her name? Um, I don't know. It's spelled A-M-I. <gasps> I thought it was a little odd when I saw I am written on this urn. Everything's just ugh. And that's how I knew that someone must have broken this urn. And made a mistake in spelling when they put it back together again. That makes more sense. Aw, oh, poor Pearl. Oh, and then we get the full thing up, and that's nice. Now, it's not full. I don't think any of the Cyclops completely reveal it, but the more Cyclops you break, the more it gets filled. Okay. Around when Mystic Maya started the channeling on that day, I was playing in the windy way with my ball. And that's when you broke the urn? Y yes I broke it. I accidentally let Mystic Amy's spirit fly away! Don't worry, Morgan will never know, okay? I'm a bad child. Breaking a village treasure is unforgivable! I thought that maybe they would make me leave the village, but... The broken pieces were pretty big, so... You thought you could put them back together and no one would notice? Yes. That was simple. I found some glue and brought it to the hallway and fixed the urn there. The hallway? You mean winding way? Yes. The channeling had already started, so I didn't think anyone would walk by. Hey, good for you, since you've apparently never gone to school, you've never done yeah. art or anything like that. That's pretty good, I'd say. And we had to put the jar back together in the uh, for last ga case of the first game. Yeah, we did. I mean, it was pretty easy, but... <gasps> it was still annoying. Mm, I see. So, about how long did it take you? It must have been a nasty repair job. Yeah, I might be strong at spiritual things. Well, when it comes to arts and crafts, I'm not nearly as skilled. When I had finished fixing the urn and looked up, I saw you coming into the manor. So that's around when Mata and I were coming back inside after reporting the murder. When I saw that, I packed everything up in a hurry. Um, Mr. Nick? What is it, Pearls? I'm... I'm going to get banished, aren't I? I really don't think that's going to happen. I mean, I bet Mr. Gamey's happy to be free from that cramped urn. Yeah, I hope so. No harm done and a happy resolution. Whew. Sacred urn updated. In you the court know record. that Morgan's gonna come by and be like, oh, <laughs> no, no, like, oh, like praying to this jar or whatever and be like, who broke my jar? <laughs> this is the place where humans bow down and worship food. I don't know. <laughs> what? <laughs> oh, that's right. That's over the hedge. The oh, I've never seen movie. that. Oh, that's one of the few really funny parts. Okay. Where, like, the raccoon's like, Oh yeah, like, the humans love food! Like, this is what they use to keep the food hot! This is what they use to keep the food cold! Like, this is all the stuff! Like, this is the device they use to summon food! It's like, they're like, oh, like, the family's like praying around the table. Like, this is where they bow down and worship food! <laughs> <laughs> Anyhow, that's it for today, everybody! Thanks so much for watching! Uh, tune in next time, we'll be able to do the rest of the investigation, no okay. problem! Let's hope we find Lada. Yeah, and until we meet again, have a great day, and God bless.